guys, so these are the products I'm going to be using for my face mask. Um, we have organic raw honey and then organic turmeric. Um, measurement wise, gosh, once I pour it out, I have a better estimate of what it's going to be. Okay, you guys, so I have washed my face using my regular O be your face wash. I have not applied anything to my skin and this is the state of my skin right now. I've been experiencing some acne breakouts uh, to the point to where my skin um, is kind of scarring. So this is what this side of my face is looking like. And then this side, I have something here that's going on, on my chin. I mean, my pores are horrible and typically, I have pretty normal skin. I typically don't have any issues. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply the face mask. Okay, so this is what the paste looks like. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply it to my skin. Um, and now you guys, this is a little, I changed the consistency throughout the month, but this one was a little bit runnier than I had anticipated. So I'm applying it all over my skin. And with the type of turmeric I'm using, it almost acts as an exfoliator. So now I'm going to be rinsing my face off and I'm going to try to use the same towel as the turmeric does stain a little bit. Hey, you guys, this is what my face is looking like for the first time. Looks a little glowy, huh? Maybe it's just me. I'm going to go ahead and apply my moisturizer. I just use whatever I have on hand, CeraVe moisturizing um, cream for normal to dry skin. Okay. Okay, so this is the second week, same routine. I did notice you guys that I was getting some redness. Um, I don't know what that's due to. It's allergy season right now, pollen is about. So just keeping up the routine though. And at this point, I'm using the turmeric and honey paste three to four times out of the week. Possibly a little overkill, which I will be talking about later on. That right there is my um, witch hazel that I'm applying to my face. All right, so now this is the third week. As you can see, I made the paste, the mask, excuse me, a little bit thicker. I found that if I use more turmeric, it's a little bit th thicker. And so applying it to my skin. And again, same routine, y'all, using the same towel. Look how yellow it's getting and rinsing it out. Now, I will be listing everything below in the description box with all the products I will be using. I will say that by the third week, I could really tell that the black spots due to acne scarring was clearing up. Um, I did experience some redness along my chin, so I, at this point, reduced the number of time I used the mask to two times a week. Ryan Little. <laughs> This is the fourth week. I only used the mask one time for this week. I didn't feel the need. Now I am, it seems like I'm being rough, but I'm not really. I'm using my Bior face mask to cleanse my face, which hazel, and then I got all of my good molecules um, serums and I will be doing a separate video on that so this is everything and again everything will be listed below in the description box my skin is really really clearing up especially on the sides this the sides is where I sleep on my pillow you guys so I tend to get acne there um, and this is a moisturizer I will be using hey you guys so here's my skin after a month of using um, turmeric and honey mask I did my uh, last mask a couple of days ago. I'm sorry I forgot to record that, but I showed you guys what my facial routine is in the morning. This is the before and after I'm going to have. And everything just looks a lot better now. In order to get some of the, the spots, I'm going to have to continue this. This is not going to be an easy thing. I'm in my 40s, so age plays a role into that too. So that is it, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.